and green. Ho, ho, ho. Thank you, so in turn. Yes, do this! What's up, everybody? Welcome back to another Jolly Tutorial video. Today, we are very <laughs> crazy excited because we, I just checked, we are at 204 subscribers! Yay! <laughs> so we're doing um, a special bonus, and I was thinking that since we started with... <laughs> since we started with Quasi Cat from the Octonauts, that we will do the very last Octonaut that is left to do. Which is Professor Inkling, right? No, it's not <laughs> What? <laughs> so we're going to do Professor Inkling today. Uh, we want to do a couple of special shout outs. Yes. Okay, so um, special shout outs to Drawing for Kids and Art with Trista. My name is Asu and we got to draw a zombie next. Um, and I, for networking with the channel, helping us grow. And also special shout out to one of the artists that we met at a convention, Mr. Panda. <laughs> Channel's Mr. Panda. And so we want to do a special shout out to him too, because he asked that. So uh, I guess if anyone else wants shout outs, let us know in the shout comments. Shout out to my channel as well. And shout out to Asherzilla2000. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Alright, so. Make sure you like on my channel as well, right? What? Yeah. You should definitely like some of these really cool videos Asher has. He's got Lego builds, Minecraft builds. Check them out. So, with that, get your three peas out. Your paper, paper pen, and pencil, your pencil. 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 And a zombie. Yeah. No. I mean, and an eraser, um, which isn't a P, it's a knee. First of all, you got to put your papers portrait, right? What I don't did you even draw? Well, that was a scribble. <laughs> so it was nothing. So first we're going to start off with a big, circle. a big circle. We love big circles. I think you might need to put <laughs> ah! <laughs> My circles are never perfect. I know. So, once you've got your big circle, we're going to go right underneath it and we're going to draw a rectangle. Oh. Uh, did I draw that right? Uh. Draw it like that. Rectangle. Okay. Rectangle. Loves it. Loves it. And now it's time for the secret. The magic tea. All right. Why is that magic tea? Not magic secret. Why is it? Ah. <laughs> Why is the secret magic tea magic? <laughs> <laughs> all right, right, all right, all right. right. So why is the secret magic tea magic? So it goes because it connects all of the points that we need. That's right. It tells us where all the pieces of the face go, right? Yeah. All, the all right. Are... So. Okay. So <laughs> once you got the first line of the magic tea, we'll make the other by just going straight across, just like that. <laughs> once you've got. Your magic tea on there. We are going to draw a little baby magical egg, just like that. Yeah? Mm -hmm. And <laughs> and then we're going to draw, we're going to use that magic tea, and we're just going to make a nice big circle oval thingy that goes starts from the magic tea and goes around all the way back up to the nose. Actually, just like that. It doesn't actually go on top of the nose, it goes underneath the nose. Like that. And then we're going to do the same thing on the other side, another ovally shape. And I think we've done this on all the octonauts now, right? Have we done that? I think we have. Right underneath these two cheeks that we just made, we're going to make connect them with a beautiful smile. Kind of a small smile. It's kind of a serious guy. Serious octopus guy, right? All right, so right underneath there, we're going to go ahead and make his bow tie real quick so that we know where it goes. We're going to use the magic tea to know where it's at, and we're just going to make a big rectangle right there. All right, using the magic tea, we're going to go on each side and make a nice big circle. 
and a big circle. And then inside that circle, we're going to make a little bit of a circle on each side. Just like that. And then what we're going to do is make his special little eyeglass thing. His uh, barnacle or man what is it? Ma manacle? Barnacle? <clears throat> Did somebody call called? barnacles? I'm so sorry, sir. I don't think they know what they're talking about. Let me help them. Um, I believe the word you're looking for is monocle. But anyway, he's got some sort of glass, and we're just going to make a big circle around this eye, just like that. All right. We're just cooking right along here with steam. And uh, what are we going to do next? Yes, what we're going to do next is we're going to use that big rectangle we just made on the bottom of this circle. And the big rectangle. We're going to make a triangle. Why? What are we doing? This is weird. It looks weird, but it's not. Trust me, right? Uh, we're going to come out of this rectangle that we made right above it, and we're going to shoot up one line, just like that, up. And then we're going to go on the other side and shoot up. Make two little hairs, little, little antennas, if you will. Then we're going to go a little bit further down that rectangle, and we're going to go down and make a line that goes down, like that. So it looks like we almost made an X, but not quite. We're going to connect them with curvy lines, slightly curvy lines, like that. That's a race, because I can't see what is happening inside this bow tie. Good stuff, I'm sure. All right. So we're going to erase the magic T even in there. Oh my goodness. What has the world come to? All right. Now we're going to... Do his little collar. And the way we do that, yes, we're going to go from that triangle and we're just going to go straight up, not halfway to, put like a little mark near the side of this rectangle. And then we're just going to draw a line to that. We're going to do the same thing, just a little line right there. And from the bottom of this triangle, we're going to draw a slanting line going straight up there. And then we can erase this. We made his uh, little collar. So we're going to make his ears. And the way we're going to do that is we're going to look where his eyeballs are. So right above his eye, right about here, we're going to draw a, a long rectangle. And we're going to do the same thing over there. Two rectangles. Two big, actually they're kind of thick. Let's make them thick rectangles. Look, kind of almost square-like. Almost square rectangles. <laughs> he looked weird. <laughs> what kind of octopus has ears? He's like a special kind of octopus. Creature report. Creature report. So now we're going to connect these two uh, rectangles that we just made. We're actually going to make them into little houses. And the way we're going to do that is we're going to put a triangle. Because, you know, when you make a house, you make a triangle roof, right? We're going to make our triangle. Except for after we have our triangle, it's not quite, he doesn't have like these sharp ears. They're kind of rounded. So what we're going to do is we're going to slightly round everything. So we're just going to kind of go round and round off the sharp edges like that. All right. Okay. And then we're going to erase that line inside of it here. In fact, yeah, we're just going to erase like that. Okay. He's got three dark circles on his head. One big one, one medium one, and one small one. Okay? This dot's right here, this tiny dot uh -huh. needs to be about... Oh, closer. Yeah. Oh, okay. Thank you. All right, so <laughs> make sure you get the placement right. So that I'm just going to leave that. Asher did a good job on putting that circle in there. Okay, so what we're going to do now is we're going to fix the rest of his collar. You'd think we're done, but we're not. We're going to just make a little slanty line right here. And we're going to do the same thing right here. And then we're going to erase. And then you're like, wait a minute. Where's his, his head? You just chopped off some of his head. I know I did, but we're going to fix that too. So we're just going to draw a little curvy line that connects it into the collar. <laughs> Hello, my name is Puma and I'm back. <laughs> All right, so I shouldn't erase the magic T, but I already did, so it's too late. So that's okay. What we're gonna do now is right in the middle of that triangle, we're gonna make a giant U shape, 
And the first U goes from the middle of that triangle, and you're going to make it go down and to the part of his bow tie. And we're going to do, again, same thing, other side. It goes down, U shape, like that. We're going to make another U. Not me, you. Yes, you. No, me, you. Yes, you. You, me. No, you, me. Me, you. Me, you. Who? drawing daddy now. It's me. Daddy. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So let's go down here to the other side. And we're going to make sort of a curved line that goes down. It's almost like a J. Like, like a fish hook, right? Yeah. And then we're going to go to the edge of his collar. And we're just going to connect it. We're going to do the same thing on the other side. Another kind of a J, right? And then another right at the edge of his collar. We're going to make another little curvy line. So we're making all his little leggies right here. Okay, we're still going. All right. Now what we're going to do is on this one, we're going to make another U shape. But this one's actually going to stick out like that. So um, before we do his last tentacle, we're going to just fill in his eyes because that's, that's fun. So we're going to, now what we're going to do is some, some of the hard stuff. And we're going to do his tentacles, which you think wouldn't be so hard, but they kind of are. Um, so the first thing we're going to do is we're going to go to this middle one. And we're going to, here's what we're going to do. We're going to go to the side here, just like that. The Kraken. Where is the Kraken? <laughs> Alright, so we're going to... What we're going to do is, I'm trying to figure out the best way to do this. We're going to make, from here, we're going to make a U or a curvy line. Let's just do a curvy line, right? And then we're going to do the same thing with this. We're going to do a curvy line up. And then we're going to do a sad face. And a sad face. All right, so that looks kind of weird, right? Uh, it's so once you have... The first tentacle like that, we're going to erase everything inside of it. And we're actually going to erase some of, half of the thing we did here. All right, so the next tentacle that Asher actually was just talking about is one that goes actually up to his face. So we're going to make a little mark over here by his cheek, right? And we're going to draw a curved line going all the way down into this little U shape that we made. And then what we're going to do is on the bottom of this U-shape, we're going to make a, another curvy line, a parallel line, if you will, that follows up, up, and then connects with this. Okay. So once we have this part, we're just going to make a little sad face right here and a little sad face right here. And we're going to make it into this tentacle. I'm not... You know what? You can kind of do whatever you want with these tentacles, but um, so that's kind of what we're You're doing. You're not plugged in. And that's one thing, Daddy. Okay, so um, you make your tentacle, and then we're going to erase all this bit in here. And something that might help with the tentacles is they start out kind of bigger, the closer to his body, and they kind of get... All right, so we're going to go to the next tentacle that just drips right down. So from here, we're just going to make a uh, little curved line. It goes down like that. We're going to make another curved line. It goes down like that and connect it. Boom. We're going to go this one, and this one just drips straight down, so we're going to make it curve down just a little bit more. And then this one's going to curve I down. So what we're going to do is we're going to drop, we're going to drip this one straight down like this. And we're kind of look where this one is here, and then we're going to curve it down like that. He's kind of hard as Professor Inkling, huh? All right, so then we're going to do the last one right now, and it just goes like, it curves down like that. Kind of like what this one's doing. Right? Yeah. Curves again, and then connects. I think we're done. I think we got them. Um, what do you think? I think you need to erase all those marks in my tentacles. That's it. Get that last one over on the other side. Thank you. After you get all these tentacles done, 
Uh, we're gonna finish off with this bow tie. We're gonna actually add a little sliver of a rectangle that clip and then erase it, if you can see, because we want to go over that triangle just a little bit. He's, he's got a really big bow tie. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go to this little bow tie, we're gonna give it a little bit of a decoration, and we're just gonna add a little line like that. It's a little line decoration. And so it looks like more of a bow tie, right? All right, now we're going to go ahead and erase the magic teeth, just like that. Uh-oh, doesn't he have a line or something on his monocle? Yeah, so draw a straight line yeah. down. What else did I forget? You also forgot the, yeah, mm. give me the pen, give me the pen. All right. Here you go. To get a lines on his monocle. Oh, okay, so Asher added a couple of little decorations inside his tie. All right, so ink these in, color them up. Uh, thank you for letting us reach 200 subscribers finally. Keep on drawing, the more you do, the better you get. You want to draw more? Well, we got more videos for you to watch. Check out any of these and please share this with all your friends. Let's get more people drawing. The more you draw, the better you get. All right, see you at the next video.